There are a handful of really important nutrients that support proper thyroid function. When you're deficient in these vitamins, minerals, and amino acids, your thyroid cannot work. When your thyroid's out of balance, you can experience symptoms of what you would never think would actually be connected to the thyroid gland, but they are. Things like hair loss in both men and women, bad skin, cold hands and feet, low energy, low metabolism, stubborn body fat that you just can't lose, and even poor sleep. So in this video series, we're gonna be exploring some of these essential nutrients that you need in order to have a healthy thyroid. Today, specifically, we're gonna be talking about iodine. Let's get into it. Let's take a look at how an iodine deficiency can hurt your thyroid and what you can do to overcome your iodine deficiency to balance your thyroid once again. Now first off, what is iodine? Iodine is a mineral that's used in a lot of different ways by your body. Small amounts of supplemental iodine can cause significant changes in thyroid function in predisposed individuals. One study quoted actually, predisposed people who supplemented with iodine were shown to have significant changes in thyroid function. Iodine is highly bioavailable in its natural form when extracted from kelp and can help support overcoming your thyroid imbalance. Iodine is needed for healthy thyroid function because it works with other minerals like zinc, selenium, and copper, which I'll also be talking about in this series, to properly produce thyroid hormone, balancing your thyroid and helping overcome or prevent either hypothyroidism or hyperthyroidism. It's important to have all these minerals in the right forms and dosages in your body for a healthy thyroid, since they all interact with one another and help balance each other out. If you're deficient in iodine or any of these other minerals, thyroid imbalance happens, it's just that simple. It's no wonder hypothyroidism and hyperthyroidism are so common in the general population right now. It's so easy to be deficient in these things if you don't supplement or eat the right foods regularly. So which thermo foods are high in iodine that you should be eating regularly? All right, first up on the list, we have seaweed or dried kelp. So one whole sheet of it uh, actually will give you a, a varying amount, but up to 2000% of the iodine that you need. Another one is raw milk. It's awesome. One cup of raw milk has 37%. Eggs, one large egg has 16%. Prunes, if you have five prunes, you get 9%. And then raw unpasteurized cheese will give you 8%. Uh, and also bananas has a small amount, just 2%, but it's still good. So if you want iodine from a supplement form, I recommend finding iodine from a kelp extract because it's highly bioavailable and very easy for your body to absorb and use. And that's why I included iodine from kelp extract in my new Umzu supplement, Thyrite, in the exact right dosage shown in the research to make the biggest impact in helping you have a healthy thyroid. If you wanna try a bottle of Thyrite for yourself and you want a 10% off coupon, just go to umzu.com slash thyroid right now. I also highly recommend eating and using the thermo diet principles to heal your thyroid. So you have a ton of energy, a high metabolism, tons of healthy hair and skin, and you feel good all the time. You can find more information about Thermo over at thermodiet.com if you're interested. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, just leave them in the comments, subscribe to the video, give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next video. Yeah.